Okay. I'm going to show you the three different what they call casts of bees or the queen, the worker, and the drone bees. <coughs> Make sure I get her in frame here. So you can see right there, that is the queen. See, she's got a longer abdomen on, a long pointed abdomen, compared to this one here on my finger, which is a worker bee. Got the queen, got a worker bee. Now, it's, oop, okay, here we go. Here's a drone. See if I can get the drone on my finger. Notice the drone. He's a lot fatter. He doesn't have the long. Uh, the queen must run over the other side. He doesn't have the long pointed abdomen. He's got. He's twice the size of a worker. He's got. His eyes are twice as fat. There's two worker. I ain't even in the frame here. These are the drones right here. They're the male bees. See so how he's a lot fatter than the little ones next to him. If you can see his. I gotta get over here on the other side so I'm not blocking the light. Right, this way. Where'd he go? Okay, right here. That dark guy right there, that's a drone. You notice the fatter abdomen. Bigger eyes. He's a, he's a drone. He's a male. All they do is eat honey and mate with the queens. Queen only mates once, but she'll mate with anywhere from 10 to 20 drones on her mating flight, and then she never leaves the hive again until she swarms, if she swarms. See if I find where the queen went. She might have dropped down in the hive right underneath me here. Hmm. Right here somewhere. Probably looking right at her. I think she made a. Oop, here she is. See her again. Make sure I got her in the view. That's the queen right there. See the longer abdomen? A lot of times the. Little spot on her thorax there is shiny. A lot of times she's not striped like the worker bees will be. See the workers around her. Now if you notice a lot of times there's a the bees will be circled around her. That'll be a court. They're always grooming her and taking care of her where this guy here that's a drone. They don't even have a stinger. A lot of people look through the hive and think that's the queen, but mm -hmm. hopefully you can tell the difference in this video. Rewind and watch them again when I'm pointing them out. But I thought I'd just let you get a look at that. Now something else I'm going to show you here. These here are drone cells, these fatter ones. Where this is worker cell. You can see it's more flat and fuzzy. The little cups on the bottom, them are some queen cells that they're starting. Let's see if I can find a find a batch of them. I got some let me show you on this frame. This hive is close to swarming. As you can see, make sure I get the view here. These are queen cells, swarm cells on the bottom. There's two there, maybe a third one. You can, I don't know if you can see down in there. Get out of the light a second here. There's some royal jelly in there and larvae. I think that was a drone cell on the side. Some of these are drone cells. But you can see how they're a lot bigger. That'll, they'll make that a little bit bigger before they cap it off. This is all worker brood. And these are drone cells up here. They usually put the drone cells around the edge. Here's some more worker brood. A little bit of honey here and there. Some 
some uh, open larvae here that you haven't capped yet. So they give you an idea what what all them different ones look like. So I hope this helps you out. I'm gonna move that frame up to the top. I might put one of them cells out. Here's my nephew's hive. this close off. Hopefully this was uh, helpful. If you like my channel, click like. Subscribe if you're not a subscriber. And uh, be afraid to leave some comments down below. Thanks for watching.